Today we're going to be unboxing the Shegu X6100 um, HF and 50 MHz transceiver which I just received from Sinatel UK Limited this morning. The price delivered is £561.97. So let's uh, get into this wrapping first and uh, take the cardboard off. So we can see straight away, this isn't a normal Shigu box. Um, in the past they've just been sort of plain uh, brown functional boxes. But it looks like they're adopting the style of the major manufacturers now. And there's a dint on the corner there. Uh, I don't know quite how that's happened because it was quite well packaged. And the box isn't sealed. I assume that's so that they could, Sinatel could check the uh, contents. So here we have a manual which is unusual in that it's um, spiral bound and it has a plastic cover as well that's quite nice and uh, unusual and there's more serial number details etc on this piece of paper so we'll set that aside delving further into the box First thing we can see is a power cable. This has just got uh, bare wires to the ends um, so you can fit your own power pole connector etc. This is a USB-C lead which is used for uh, charging the transceiver and I think also uh, comms as well. This is the microphone lead, modular at both ends. And then the microphone itself, which is the classic Shegu design, um, based on a ICOM design. I'll take out this uh, free gift. This is a gift that's been offered by Sinatel at the moment. It's uh, a Shegu watch. Uh, let's have a look at this for a moment. I think this is just for December, but they may carry on uh, with this. They did it on the, I think it was the G90s, uh, when they first started selling them, they gave the watches. So um, we'll see whether that continues. Quite a nice looking watch. Put that aside as well. Next here we've got the power supply. This is a charger, should I say, rather than a, a power supply. Um, there's a charger there, Euro style. <coughs> I think it's about an amp, and um, that's used to uh, to charge the radio. Okay, let's put that aside, and onto the main uh, transceiver itself. So it's, it's good weight to it, similar feel to the X5105, very solid feeling. Um, so it's uh, made of aluminium. Nice. Uh, Nice size, feels very very solid, and um, connectors on both uh, both sides of the unit. Um, on one side you've got all your interfacing, on the other side you've got the uh, antenna connector and power connector etc. Um, but again a very very solid unit. Um, the screen seems to be much better than the X5105s as far as um, how it's mounted so uh, but a very nice looking transceiver so that's about it really well thank you for watching just a quick unboxing hopefully uh, in the next few days we can look at some of the functions uh, of the rig itself